friends, welcome back to my new panning channel. This is my second video on this channel. I do have a main account where I do all of my unboxings and beauty related content, but this is specifically for all my panning projects. So I will leave my main channel down below if you are not familiar with that. If you're just here for the panning, thank you for being here. I really appreciate it. I've been wanting to do this for a while, so I'm still excited about it and I'm happy that you're here with me. So today we're gonna do an update on my Happy Hour Project Pan. <laughs> I'm filming this a little early. It's actually the 8th right now and the updates go up on the 12th. Um, I'm going to be at a conference. I won't have time to film it that day. So we're a little early. I did not do a video for the first one because I was kind of rushed <laughs> to figure out my products. Uh, but I really wanted to do this project because I like happy hour. This project is part of the Fantastic Ladies collab. It was created by Danny from Danny's Makeup and Deb B. So thank you ladies for coming up with this because I love the theme. I really do. Um, I just realized I didn't do my eyebrows yet today. I'm going to need to do that. Sorry. It's a weird morning. I'm getting ready to go to a conference. So I'm actually filming this early. This is the 8th. The update is not until the 12th, which is when you'll see it. But I have to film now because I'm going to be in New Orleans when this happens. So. Um, because I didn't do an intro, you probably don't know what my products are. So my first product was Prompt 15, which is Dive Bar or Hole in the Wall. So this is a product from a smaller or lesser known brand. I chose my Pretty Primer from OMFG Cosmetics because they're a small indie brand. I don't know what's going on with them now. Um, it seems like they're kind of on hiatus still. So this is in the shade Caramel Sauce. I needed, <laughs> I needed a small brand. I did not need to start another eyelid primer right now, but that's what we got. So I've only used it once because I am trying to use up the primer I'm using now. I'm thinking I might take this on my trip, although it's kind of messy. So I don't know. I might just leave it. But yeah, I've only had one use. <laughs> So not very good start. That's okay though. It's okay, right? Okay, the next prompt is number 21, New Year's Eve, ringing in the new year. So um, that means like exposing the ring of the pan in the product. So I chose my Real Her Incomparable eyeshadow. I love this thing and I, I had already hit pan on it. So I just thought if I hit side pan that works for the prompt. So I have expanded my pan and up towards the side pan. I'm, I actually am mostly using this, like I'm not specifically going for that spot when I use, um, use it for my crease, but this is, yeah, <laughs> if I use it on my lid, I do kind of go up towards there. So I actually have used this the most of everything in the project so far. I've used this 13 times. I don't have a usage goal on it. I have a pan goal, but I'm still keeping track for some reason and it's been 13 times. So I do enjoy this product. Okay, the next prompt was 24 Martini, which is an item with an odd shaped packaging and we sure got that. It's the Glam Light Pizza Palette. <laughs> so if you have this palette, you know it's a little awkward. It is great shades though, great quality. Um, my goal is to use this 10 times. I have used it two in this past month. So I've used the purples over here for a purple look one day. And then I used these browns for a look as well. And this one was just too dark. Like it, ugh. I used it on my inner corner for some crazy reason and it was too dark. So I kept trying to lighten it up with other shades. Um, I did use shimmers from other palettes when I did these. I have not used the shimmers in this palette yet. There's only a few. There's only three shimmers in here. So I think, it, you know, needing to resort to other shimmers is not a big deal when you only have three to go off in here. But yeah, I am 20% to my goal. So 
I'm not, my goals usually I try to make attainable because I don't want to end up like hating the products by forcing myself to use them too much. I don't want to overuse and like just put too much product on just because I'm trying to get through stuff. So, you know, I set reasonable goals and 10 uses for that palette I think is reasonable. Okay, the next prompt is 25, another round, which is an item you love so much you either repurchased it or purchased it for a friend. Well, that would be the ColourPop Limoncello palette. I love this palette and I ended up buying it for my best friend. Oh, uh, <laughs> we actually have a thing. There's a um, restaurant bar that we sometimes go to when we want to celebrate um, and they usually end up giving us a shot of limoncello during the night. It's horrible stuff, but it's like our thing, you know? So I bought her this palette and it's beautiful. Um, <laughs> side stories, right? So I wanted to use this one 15 times and again, I have used it too. So absolutely gorgeous palette. I don't know why they put that blue in there, but I love this and I'm glad I'm going to be getting more use out of it. All right, my last prompt that I had picked for this starting round was 39 Peanuts, a product that is messy to use. And um, I'm just not good with nail polish, so I chose a nail polish. This is Pacifica's Plant Magic and it is the shade Hope Ranch. I want to use this five times. I've not used it yet, but I am taking it on this trip with me and I plan to use it on the trip. Um, <laughs> I like to pamper myself when I go to conferences. So I take a whole bunch of sheet masks and I do my nails and, you know, I just take care of myself because it's stressful being out of town and working and all that. So probably not the most exciting update for this project that you're gonna see but I'm trying. All right, I feel like I have blabbed enough. I don't know what I'm saying anymore, so I'm going to say goodbye. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you do want to see more of my panning projects, feel free to subscribe to this channel. If you want to see more unboxing content, check out my other channel, Cece's Trial Size Life, and I'll see you in the next video. And now I'm going to go do my eyebrows. Bye! So I used purples. I did a purple look one day.